Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Mike from MoboxGraphics.com and in this video tutorial, I'm just gonna show you how to do pixel art in Adobe Illustrator. So it's pretty simple, we're not breaking new ground here, uh, but it's just something that I have to build for a future tutorial. Um, so I figured I might as well just show you how it's done. So um, I'm just gonna create a new document here in Adobe Illustrator and I'm gonna set it to 1000 by 1000 and set the color mode to RGB. So um, the width and height you're gonna want to remember. So under the line tool here, I'm gonna start by making a grid. So if I, under the, you know, under the line tool, if I just click and hold, I could uh, select the rectangle grid and tap the corner. So what this does is it brings up this, this little options menu and this is where you wanna to remember to put in your, the size of your, uh, of your document. So if I put a thousand by a thousand, it'll know to create the grid across the whole thing. If I said 500 by 500, it would create kind of a grid just here in the top left corner. Um, the number of dividers is obviously how many lines um, in the horizontal and vertical direction. Since this is perfectly 1000 by 1000, these will be the same. So I'm gonna set this to maybe 100 and this one to 100 and just hit okay. So now we have our grid, pretty simple stuff. But now we want to be able to paint in between the lines here. And to do that, you just wanna select the whole grid. Under this uh, shape builder tool, you're just gonna click and hold and come down to live paint bucket. So what this allows you to do when you zoom in here and you select a black color, for example, it allows you to paint within the lines. Um, you can click and hold or you could just select one by one, or you can click and drag down. Um, but it's pretty simple from there on out. Um, so for this video, I'm just going to create a, um, like a mouse kind of clicker. So I'm just going to follow this guide that I see um, online. So first thing I'm going to do is, let's see, I'm going to create a new layer underneath and I'm going to paint it uh, a different color. So as you know, a mouse pointer has white and black on it. So uh, since the background's white and I'm painting in white, it's not, I'm not gonna be able to see it. So I'm just gonna select this bottom layer and create a rectangle and maybe make it kind of a blue color. I'm gonna, I'll delete this later, but now it's blue. And then I could just lock that layer so I don't accidentally grab it. And now when I zoom in here, selecting the grid and the paint, the live paint bucket, I could start painting. So I'm gonna start with my white and I'm just tracing this from online. Okay, so now that you're done, all you need to do is um, take a look up here in the layer group. So all of these layers are just like combined under this group, under a group called Live Paint. So to release those, you could just select the grid, right click, go to ungroup. So that ungroups it. And then go to object, Live Paint, expand. And now when you open this up, you'll notice that there's a mouse and then there's the grid. And now you can just delete the grid if you want. Um, so that's just a quick look at how to do um, pixel art in After Effects. So um, from, I'm sorry, from Illustrator. So um, from here on out, you can move that into Adobe uh, After Effects and do whatever your heart desires. So anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a like, subscribe, and check out more videos on this channel. Anyways, guys, it's been Mike from Mobox. Thanks for watching.